Hello everyone, welcome back to Amori. Oh man, y'all, I just made the worst omelet this morning. <laughs> no, so disappointed. Okay, um, an impressive statue of Sweetheart cast a discomforting shadow over the garden. Okay, time to put in the password. Yeah, I'm so mad. Like, I had an- I made an omelet this morning, and I just did not have the right cheese for it. Um, okay. Was it sweet? I thought it was like sweet donut jelly filled. Sweet jelly filled donut. That seems about right. I'm pretty sure- I'm not sure about the sweet one, but the other three words I'm pretty sure are right. Fine! Uh, okay, awesome. Area clear. Time to go in. I'm still thinking about my omelet, god. <laughs> like, I did a thing where, um... I, uh, let me just wait, switch to Aubrey. Where the cheese in my house, like, weren't very usable. Um, initially I was gonna use some shredded cheese, but then it had mold on it. And then I was gonna go with the, um, what's it called? The American cheese. But then it, I don't know if it tastes good or not. Dear sweetheart, I love you so much. Let us have kids for the rest. Oh, what the hell? That is fan. I don't know if the presents are loaded across the floor. I literally want to open all these presents right now. Do I get to paint? Oh. Oh wait, yeah, yeah. I'll just- okay. Get all this. So yeah, no, no, no. So then I ended up using, um, jack cheese. Just like sliced jack cheese and that did not go very well because the jack cheese didn't melt and so they were just- there- there'd be these globs of jack cheese as I was eating the omelette and it was just not the best thing. Like, I think shredded's probably the way to go and it just- uh, I'm so disappointed because I thought it would really work, but I also realized I don't like jack cheese that much in my omelets. That's pickles. Oh yeah, let's eat some. Like I just, I just don't want to have like a spicy feel when I eat my my omelet and then be like, ooh, spicy. Like no, like maybe it was the jack cheese, but I was just not enjoying myself this morning. All right, let's see. Besides my my bad breakfast story. Oh, oh, we're fighting. Oh, we're fighting. Oh, I thought we were gonna talk because there was a question mark, but you know, whatever. I guess we're strong. I'm sure we can take this bear out in one hit, or at least one round. I don't think anyone in the group can run KO someone, at least at the Sweetheart Castle. <clears throat> oh no! Hero. Oh, hey, we're chill. Yeah, we're chillin'. Hate how it maxes at 650. But you know, whatever. You found a teddy bear. Oh, awesome. So you are, you're my queen. Uh, please respond. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. Um, can I use... Okay, yeah. I want to... Well, actually, no, no. What am I doing? There are pickles right there. We can just heal up. Duh. Duh, Snistic. Duh. Okay. Which way? This way? Ooh, a Mari picnic basket. I feel like we're gonna have to face a big foe up here. All right, let's go. Huh, we're back here again in the stage. That's weird. Oh snap, okay. We finally made our way out. Well, we can go out like down there, right? Whoa, what's with all these decorations? It looks like someone's about to get married. Uh-oh, the show's about to start. Let's hide. Oh. <laughs> How are we back here again? Welcome all, welcome all. Today is the most monumentous occasion. After 42 sessions of Sweetheart's Quest for Hearts, it is now time to air our final episode. <gasps> it, Sniff, has been a splendid run. So in the first run, sniff. Thank you all for your viewership. As long as we have been on air, we have rigorously looked for a perfect suitor for our beloved sweetheart. And each time regretfully, sweetheart was unable to find our one true love. But this time we believe that we have truly outdone ourselves. D really? This is the moment to end all moments. History begins here. N dim the lights, please. Oh man, what's gonna happen? The final episode begins now. Ooh. Let us commence the wedding. 
Who is she getting married to? Please, welcome to the aisle. Sweetheart's perfect suitor. It's not like bagging on Hero, is it? Here comes the bride, all dressed in white. It's a cake. What? Sweetheart suitor is herself? Yes, it's true. You've seen everything. The answer has been obvious all along. The only suitor magnificent enough for Sweetheart is Sweetheart herself. Wait, she's been married to herself? Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> Silence. Okay. Ahem, let's begin the ceremony. She's getting married to herself? Uh. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today. <laughs> See, where's Mary herself? That's so lame. Don't laugh, Kel. I actually feel kind of bad for her. Oh, don't. Now, does anyone object to this holy matrimony? Speak now, forever hold your peace. In that case, by the power vested in me, I cannot pronounce you. Sweetheart and sweetheart. That's so lame. You may now kiss the. I object! Stop this way immediately! Who? What? Aubrey! Don't do this, sweetheart! The wedding is a sham! Loving yourself is one thing, but this is taking it way too far! Not you again! How dare you step back foot in here! Guards! Guards! Sweetheart, you're making a mistake! You can't just marry yourself! There's someone out there for you! I know it! Aubrey- Aubrey, what are you doing?! She's gonna send us to the dungeon again! <sighs> you understand nothing, random hero fan. <laughs> I was a young princess once. I too once thought there was someone for me out there in the universe, but all that's in the past now. I no longer believe in true love. Aww. I'll never love anyone else ever again. Aww. The only person I'm going to love from, my na from now on is myself. Now guards, seize her! Um, hero? I don't think this is a good idea. Shut up! Sweetheart, listen to me! You don't have to do this! W what's this? Could it be? Hero! My hero has come for me! No, hero, don't! You have Mari! <laughs> A oh, sweet hero, I knew you wouldn't leave me alone like this. How can you sweat how you swim with your words? Although it may be over between us, my heart still has not forgotten you. I'll give you one last chance. Nope, don't do it. Don't do it. Marry me, hero. Here and now Nope. Do so and I will let your fans live. Wait wait, what? I can't do that. That's crazy. Oof. Cold heart rejection. The dish best served freezing. What's this? You rejected me. Again. But, how could this be? Cause, you know, I don't understand. Oh, the woes of love. Time to face off against Sweetheart! Ooh, bitch! Hmm. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> Uh oh, now you've done it. Ah, yes, I see everything clearly now. I'll admit, I was wrong about you, hero. I thought you were a worthy companion, but it seems to me you're jealous of me, just like everyone else. Yes, that must be it. My dazzling looks, my charming smile, my gregarious personality. It must be so difficult for you to under even uh, even stand in my presence. Well, there's no need to despair anymore. I will end your suffering, personally. Let's go. You're about to go down, sweetheart. Ooh, she's got a wand? Farewell, miserable peons. Ooh, I'll lock you up in the dungeon forever. Ooh, she's got like a, one of those thingamajigs. It's like what Rem has. Oh. Her character design is very cute, though. Hack away. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine here. Ricochet. Yeah, no, we should be okay. I'm still wondering what happened to her and Captain Space Boy. I feel like that's got a chance, hasn't it? Ho ho ho. Ho 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 ho. Are we all angry now? Ayo! Doesn't that mean we hit harder? <laughs> so, it's pointless, you fools. You cannot dampen my positive energy. So you're hard to become happy. So you're not like number to even sad or happy. Amori. Here comes out some more. Hey, that was nice. 
Ooh, dull attack, dull attack. Well, how much we got? Ooh, okay, it might take a while. Yeah. Oh, no, no, hold on. Um, wind up. No, 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 no. Mori hack away. Yeah, let's do this one. Three attacks. Ricochet. Maybe Hero should do some attacks too. That might actually be a better plan. Fools, you should be groveling on your knees. Ha ha ha. I mean, amazing. That it's cool that Sweetheart has a bunch of self confidence. Oh, wow, Mori. Oh, shoot. Okay. Ooh, no, we're about to hit, uh, move the kidder. Um, okay, Hero might need to do some healing. Heroing. <laughs> Oh, my beauty, your grace, balance, ever. It's a shame that you'll be able to enjoy it for much longer. Oh, shit. Um, is there a full health thing? I know Hero can probably do it, but I don't know if he'll make it in time. Might as well you try and figure out you with all the healing stuff. Alright. Ah! Uh, okay, yeah, no kill. Ah! Uh, okay, hero, let's see if you can make this work. Okay, hero, come on, come on. Bring it for me, bring it for me. Ooh, Amori! Nice! Ooh, shit! Sweetheart! Oh man, our health, our health, come on. Why- why is Hero like the last one to attack? I thought he was faster than Aubrey, what the hell? Okay, sure. Okay, I was like, why didn't kill Heal? Oh. Oh yeah, oh she's almost down. She's down for the count. No, yeah, no, we got this, it's fine. Be a hero, just keep providing everyone with health. So we're fine. She attacked once as long as she does as long as he does she doesn't attack Mori. Oh man, she's looking extra crazy. Come on, hero. No, Amori, okay, all right, sure. Ooh, Amori, that was hard, hard hitting. All the hundreds, man. Oh, did we get it? Yes, no, is this, they called the defeat? I cannot accept this, I will not accept this. You're all nothing but a bunch of lowly peasants. Foo dang. We couldn't even get our meter up all the way to get the energy burst. <laughs> oh my God. How could this be? You- you're all nothing. How dare you defy me? Throw them in the dungeon. Guards, guards! Ooh, they were defeated. Ooh. It's over, sweetheart. The wedding is cancelled. No, I can't accept this. Just leave me alone. Captain Space Boy. Come on. Bring it in. Crash through the palace. Oh my gosh. Yes! Or- My sweetheart! Oh, my sweetheart, I'm so relieved that I made it in time. You must stop this madness at once! Uh, Captain Space Boy! You! You idiot! I thought I told you to never show your face in front of me again. Oh, sweetheart. My sweetheart. My sweet jelly-filled donut. Please, look into your heart and give me another chance. I should have not kept you waiting all those days. What? Why did you even break up? You- What are you doing? Oh, they already left. I'm sorry I didn't do this sooner. 
Mary, 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 Oh my! This is all so sudden! How, 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 how romantic! Sproul Mount Mike, I order you to marry us immediately! Yes, at once, my liege. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today. Oh, don't forget the formalities, Mike. Just true love cannot wait. Y yes, my princess. Ahem. <laughs> by the power vested in me, I now pronounce you sweetheart and space husband. You may now kiss the bride. Oh. What? Censored. Oh, sweetheart. Let us travel the universe together and leave all this behind. Yes, yes, my husband. I won't go anywhere as long as with you. What happened, though? Let us let us take our leave, my sweetheart. We have been apart for too much long. Too long? Too long. Come, my sheep awaits. Yes, of course, my dear. But first, there's one last thing I must do. Spread my mic. Hand me the button. At once, my queen. The button? Is she gonna, like, destroy her own castle? Like, what? But it's so pretty here. <laughs> they're, they're all, their own seats right there, oh my gosh. We won't need this anymore. <laughs> what, what is she doing? I'm ready now, dear. At long last, we can be- But why did they break up? Come, my tree- My tree- Queen, our chariot awaits. I mean, okay. All is well, it ends well. At least we have the quest items and we can go back and deliver them to the the person in the library and then the person who needs the teddy bear. And then we need to go to Otherworld. Okay, there's like three places we need to go. We still haven't found Basil though, so I don't know what that's all about. So much for a happy ending. I don't think that's gonna end well at all. Yeah, I guess this was a complete waste of time. I mean, uh, uh, your bond with your friends became stronger. Everyone's follow-up moves improved. Oh, that's awesome. Nice. Oh, shoot. Now we need to run out of here, huh? Okay. Oh! What the heck? What? Oh no, something's wrong. Basil? Whoa! What's the matter, Mori? Is there something wrong? Basil. a long way down. Do you want to jump? Yep, let's go! And everyone's gonna be like, Amori, wait! Oh no, we all jumped down. Okay. Huh. I remember one of the um, NPCs told us about the underground library or something, right? Is that it? Oh wow, how long is long? Those are Basil's flowers from his grandma. White aigret orchid. It's the language of the flowers that symbolizes the phrase, my thoughts will follow you into your dreams. Weird. This is the underground library, right? Okay, well, nothing to go but forward but down. Found a book of interest. Do we need an excerpt? Yeah, sure. One by one, they fell asleep on the car ride home. It was a long day at the beach. After all, everyone was exhausted. Blank was the first to nod off, and then the rest. At the sun set over the freeway, Blank's head accidentally dropped onto Blank's shoulder. The sun jolt wakes him, but he doesn't dare open his eyes. He pretends to be asleep and studies his breathing. He listens to the sounds of the road. He feels the soft sunset riding on his skin, and the slight tinge of pain on his nose from tomorrow's sunburn. He is happy. Very, very happy. And he makes a vow to himself that no matter what, he'll remember this moment forever. It's like real life, huh? Hmm. Can't run, so... It's interesting. Okay, I don't see anything else over here. Cut! Amori cut! Amori cut! Okay, cool. Oh man, I can barely see what's on the screen. 
Another book of interest? Yeah. A puddle of juice, juice sinks into the carpet. Hovering above it was none other, none other than Blank holding an open juice box. He looks around his friends who are wearing all the same face of disappointment. He lets out a guilty chuckle. It, in what seems like less than a second, Blank disappears at the front door. A tiny black cannon makes her way across the stain, leaving sloppy wet tracks all across the carpet. Blank's face r turns red and yells for Blank, but Blank is already long gone. Blank hands Blank some wet paper towels. It looks like they're, only, they're the only adults here. And if they don't clean this up soon, the carpet's gonna stain. We'll have to deal with Blank later. Hmm, is this like a Morian friends? Feels like it though, right? Oh, I guess can't go down that way. Oh, another excerpt. You find a book of interest, yep. This year, Blank was lucky enough to get assigned to a desk next to a small window. Every day during class, Blank would gaze listlessly through the opening at the shadows of the trees, the clouds creeping overhead. His mind drifted elsewhere, into his own worlds, his own stories, his own adventures. He had a habit of doing this. It was easy for him to get lost. Today was the same as any other. Blank stared vacantly out at the small window as the clouds passed by one by one. Suddenly, a, a hard, planful, planful, playful slap slaps his back, snapping him out of his reverie. Blank looks away from the opening. Blank smiles. He motions the class is over and that it is finally time for lunch. It's pizza, pizza day today and they need to bolt to the cafeteria before it's all gone. Blank stomachs growls. He looks at the small window for one last time. He would have to continue his adventure another day. These are all nice memories, right? Hmm. No? Nothing, nothing more? Oh, is that another one? It's sunset. A strange statue watches over the hidden lake. It might have meant something significant in the past, but the time has made it has made its engravings illegible. Either way, it doesn't matter to the company visiting it today. They're only here to use it as their diving board. The brothers take turns jumping off the statue. Blank jumps first, then Blank, then Blank again, then Blank again. The brothers gleefully urge Blank to join them, and after some time of careful thought, where Blank warily agrees. Blank shuffles up the statue and looks down at the moving water. He can hear his heartbeat. His ears begin to ring. His legs feel as they would give out any time. He tries to focus on his breathing. He feels something crawling on his shoulder, and his eyes fly open to meet those of, the, of a black spider. In an instant, Blank loses all sense and hurls himself into the lake. Water fills his nose. He exerts his limbs, but the water is stronger. He's too weak, too helpless, or that what, or that is what he believes. Blank shuts his eyes and waits for the brothers to save him. Oh. Nothing. Another letter, L. Seven keys lost. Basil. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh no. Or maybe not. Oh, no. What is Basil looking at? The the creature with the eyeball. I wonder what that's supposed to represent. It's... I can't... I don't know what that says. White space again? Jeez. Oh, Looks different, the light bulb. Is it time to go back to reality? Nothing. Oh, I didn't get to, I didn't get to the end. My bad. Too gung ho. Yeah, nothing. I mean, we did find slightly more keys. Black. That definitely does say black at the bottom. Alright, well. Let's run around for a little bit, but if not, the only thing to do is stab ourselves, right? So...
Oh goodness, time to go back to reality. Two days left. Uh, before I leave, right? Okay. And we have to solve the mystery of what's going on here, emotionally, internally. It's probably kill, but let's see what our mom has to say. Hey Sunny, it's mommy. Are you doing okay? You haven't been answering my calls or responding to my voicemails. If you keep ignoring me, I'll start getting worried again. I hope you're pacing your chores. I don't even think I could finish everything in one day. Did you end up visiting Kel? If not, that's alright. I understand. Just take things at your own pace. By the way, can you check on the closet downstairs and see if there's anything you want to keep? I'll probably just throw away whatever you don't want anymore. There are only two days left before I come pick you up. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Old computer. As they say, new game of blackjack every morning, right? Okay, so we got nine. Nine plus four is thirteen. Nine, thirteen. Wait, oh no! I was like, what's thirteen plus nine? That's like twenty-two, right? Okay, that's fine. New game. No, oh shoot. That's eighteen's a good number. I'll stay at eighteen. Okay. I mean, they have 12. Stay. I stay. Okay, alright. What do they have? 15 plus 4? It's 19? Damn it. Okay. I do not have $100. 5. Yeah, fine. Hit me. What is it? 16? 16 plus 4. 20. That's pretty good. 20 is a pretty good number. They got 21. Wow, okay. Uh, hit. That is. Wait, um, ace is 1 or 11, right? So 1, 4, 10, 24. Wait, 24? No, no, no. 4, 4 plus 10 is 14, so I need to hit again. No, I busted. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, man. Okay. Hit. 10, 13. Oh. I did get blackjack. Well. Okay, let's quit out of this. We're not here to play blackjack. Though I do enjoy that they have this in the game, though. Hmm. I wonder what closet my mom's talking about, though. Ah, oh, shoot. I wonder if I should um, look that up before I answer the door. This just goes to the kitchen? Yeah, okay, it just goes to the kitchen. Okay. Yeah. Can I go outside here? No, Amori does not want to go outside. Okay. Or not Amori. Ha ha ha. Sunny does not. No. Alright, well. I guess we have nothing to do, so let's go see Kel. Hello? Hello? Sunny? Are you there? That's totally not Kel's voice. It's gotta be more in the back throat and sound like a shonen protagonist. Yeah, let's open the door. And let's go figure out, um, Basil and Aubrey Parbum. Or no, Hero's home, right? Hero's home? Hi, Sonny! Top of the morning to you! <laughs> Ooh, is that a reference to Jack said the guy? What? Well, more like noon, actually. Turns out Hero's not coming back until dinner today, so I thought I'd drop by a little later. Aw, Mom is having me- Mom is having me buy some stuff at Faraway Plaza before he comes back, and I thought it might be fun if we went together. Yeah, let's go. Do you want to come along, Sonny? Of course you do, come on! Let's go! Oh, Sad. I want to see Hero, but I guess we'll see him eventually. Kel smells. What the heck? What happened here? Dang, it must have been Aubrey and the Scooter Gang. Sunny, do, let's be honest. Do I smell? No. Oh, this dog is so cute. Let's go to Faraway Plaza. Do, do, do. It was higher, right? Shoot, yeah, yeah, it was higher. Though, I do want to visit the couple at the church, right? I think that was another, um, sort of place that was there. <gasps> Ooh, is that family? Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh, there's trash. Ooh, yeah, let's pick up some trash. Basil! H hey, Kel. Hey, Sunny. What's up, Basil? Nice to see you out and about. Are you feeling better after yesterday? Huh? Yesterday? What do you mean? You had a big stomachache, didn't you? 
That's when you have to go to the bathroom. Oh, all right. Yeah, I feel much better now. Did you want to hang out with us today? Sunny's not going to be around for much longer, you know. I mean, I don't know. Maybe tomorrow. I mean, sorry. Oh, don't worry. You don't have to force yourself. We can always catch up later. Yeah, you're right. Okay, then. See you later, then, I guess. Oh, man, yeah. Him and Sunny definitely have some beef or have some, like, history. Oh, what the heck? Hey, neighbor. How's it going? Kel's just so awesome. Hi, Kel. Oh, and who else is with you? Oh, wait. I recognize you. It's Sunny, isn't it? Sorry, it's been a while. I think we only met a few times. My family has always lived here, but I was sent off to the boarding school for a few years and just came back about three years ago, I think. Hey, Sunny! Chris is my next-door neighbor and she's really cool. She's the fastest swimmer in school. When she's in the water, people compare her to a mermaid, or a shark, or even a torpedo. I like how they have the showcasing her dyed hair with the roots and all. Oh, Kel, you're never short on compliments, haha. <laughs> when you're trying, to fit, trying out for the junior varsity basketball team this year, I'm sure you'll be able to, you'll be a shoe in <laughs> Well, I'll try. I've been playing every now and then with strangers at the park. I think I'm getting better, but still a little hard to tell. <laughs> but if I practice basketball as much as you practice swimming, I'd probably have a better chance. Oh, I'm not a hard worker. It just feels like fun to me, honestly. And besides, even though I love swimming in pools, I love swimming in the ocean even more. I love everything about the ocean. The beach, the sound of waves, even the smell of seaweed. Ah, uh, <laughs> sorry, I must sound a little obsessed. And that's totally fine! It's good to be passionate about something, isn't it? <laughs> I guess. Actually, I think this all started because I went to boarding school on an island and really enjoyed my time there. The ocean reminds me of a few friends that I made there. Hope maybe I can see them again one day. But... For the time being, I guess I'll be collecting seashells and stuff. You know, that kind of still reminds me of this, but Sunny's actually moving on far away from here soon. Maybe you can give him some tips on how to handle moving away to a new place. Man, Kel is just... Uh, oh, Sunny's moving? Hmm. Well, being away from my friends was pretty tough at first, but change is a fact of life. Okay. But it's the memories that we make with them that should, we should cherish. You know what? I just decided on something. If you see any seashells, can you bring them to me? They're kind of hard to find around here, but I'll make sure it's worth it. You gonna give me some money? Phew. Making patties is hard work, but once I sink my teeth into that tender, juicy burger, it's all gonna be worth it. Mmm, I can almost taste it now. Mmm. Dear, pay attention! The patties are burning! Oh shoot! Thanks, hon. That was close. What a lovely day for a picnic. I brought my specialties. Chicken pot pie, lemon pie, and of course my world-famous apple pie. That's too many pies, yo. Like, I don't think I've even eaten that many pies at once. <sighs> Drink apple juice. Um, okay, yeah, yeah. We don't have as much money in this world, though, but apparently orange juice is better than apple juice in the the real life. Two dollars? No, dude. We don't, have any, we don't have that much coin to spend. No, well, it's a nice view. Okay, sure, ma'am. Trash, trash, trash. Where's the trash? Trash here? I need money, so give me your trash. Give me your trash. I guess we gotta look around more to see everyone's trash, right? Okay. So, uh, oh, no, no, fuck. Okay, so... Apparently the guys who are picking up trash that ain't us have been feeling a little bit fishy. Oh. Huh, what the heck? Oh yeah, these these lots. We are we are recycultist. Oh, dude, recycultist. Oh, that's funny. Oh my gosh, recycultist. Uh, that, that's I, I get it now. I get it. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you take my trash and then give me money? Thank you. Is that? Okay, so at least it does it all at once. Thank goodness. Okay, far away plaza. That's where we're going, right? Oh. Let's see. I'm pretty sure we gotta go to Gino's Pizza and the bakery at Other Mart. Lead the way, Sunny. Gino's Pizza. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Ooh. I was saying, can you believe and her, but then, hmm. Hmm. That was like the time we like, yeah, and then honestly, I think that, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. You trash around here? Oh, who's this? Yesterday, I was eating a banana. Found a cool overgrown lake and area just behind the park. But soon after, a bunch of hooligans and scooters rolled out and kicked me out. To make matters worse, they even threw away my banana. Oh. Can't let a bunch of kids to boss me around, so there's a lake behind the park. I'm an adult now. A young adult, at least. Ugh. Aren't we all? 
Wait, let me just check if there's trash. Gotta make sure I do the due diligence of keeping the environment safe. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Why are we getting a Gino's? Oh, hey, it's Aubrey and her friends. Wow. Gino's Pizza is the bomb. This is one of the most disgusting, dirty, greasy looking cheese pizzas, and that's just the way I like it. Let's dig in. So, munch, munch, munch. We're still on the go, our secret hangar soup ah, today. I'm grabbing my fishing pole. Munch, made it myself. I love a cool stick and jump rope yesterday. Didn't think it would work, Charlie. Huh, Charlie? Heh. <laughs> so, we're going to hit the secret hangout spot again. Munch, that's a perfect date spot. Munch, I'll be sure to bring one of my special ladies. Swimming, munch. Sounds pretty fun. Well, munch. While you're fully around being babies, I'm gonna be busy skipping rocks. I've been looking for the perfect rocks all week. Wow, that must be a huge lake or something. Uh, you can try all your walking, but you know it'd be Aubrey's record. Shut up, Mikhail. Like any girls would wanna go to the lake with you without paying them. I told you to call me the Maverick. Ah, I bit my tongue. Ah, ha ha. What a loser. Ha ha. Are you hurt? You're. Pe you pay for this game. Bah! I mean, we just gotta avoid them, right? So, like. Hello and welcome to Gino's Pizza. What can I get for you? Hi, I'm, pick up I'm here to pick up an order. I see. What would you like? Oh, I know. Would you like pizza? Nom nom. I think my mom placed an order, in an order for a hero sandwich this morning. I'm just here to pick it up. Oh, I see. You're the family that keeps ordering sandwiches instead of pizza. What the fuck? Okay, fuck off with that. I can order sandwiches, but it's on the menu, isn't it? Huh, <sighs> yeah, you're right. I guess so. Okay, I'll get it. Like, what is this attitude? Are you order sandwiches and pizza? You know. I don't know if I ever told you this, but that's why my brother's nickname is Hero. You think it's because of some really cool reason, like he saved a puppy when he was a kid or something? But no, he just really likes sandwiches. Okay, here's your hero sandwich. Please enjoy. We got Kel's pizza order. Cool, thanks! Alright, we gotta go now, Sunny. I'm ready when you are. We should get the cookies from the bakery at other mart. Well, should we like talk? An old jukebox. Yeah. You insert the Mary CD Gino's jukebox. Sure. What song do you want to play? Mary CD. Uh, this is pretty Mary. Yeah. Oh, this is an original song by Toby Fox? Oh, wow! Hey, can we just talk straight up to Aubrey? Nope. Uh, my tongue. Flat. Sending Kel, what are you doing here? Don't you know through the bottom people when they're eating? Ew, it's a nerd. Grubble, grubble. Ah, uh, yes. No, 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 I didn't mean- ah. Uh. Too gung ho when I'm pressing Z, y'all. Okay, munch, munch. Careful, careful. Who's this? Charlie. Okay. All right, we'll bounce. We gotta go to the bakery. Where was the bakery? Oh no, it was in the back. Let's go to the bakery. My mom placed an order there. Bakery, bakery. Oh yeah, here it is. What are those people doing? Welcome to our family bakery. What would you like? Hi, I'm here to pick up- Oh, hi, I'm here to pick up an order. Hmm. Ah, oh, yes, your mother said you'd be coming, though. I expected you to be a little bit early. What the fuck? Can you just- Just grab my shit and then just shut the fuck up, okay? Jeez. Did you know? This bakery belongs to Mikkel's family. I guess you can't really tell because he wears a horrible yellow wig all the time. Seems like he's making a pretty big effort to stand out and be different. Here's your order, sir. We hope to see you again soon. Please enjoy the baked goods. You got Kel's ba- What is Kel's bakery order? What did he eat it and we don't even know what he bought? Like, what? Like, what? Wait, can- It's just a bag. He just got a bag? Like, okay. I mean, I'm gonna assume he just bought like two baguette sticks or something, but... Baked goods, check. Sandwiches, check. Well, that's everything, just in time, too. It looks like the sun's about to- sun's about to set! What?! <laughs> okay, I guess. I, I mean, as long as we get to go see a hero, that's fine. Okay. Um, before we go see a hero, I want to check on the uh, church. Because I remember the lady with the- what's it gonna call it? 
Um, yeah. Hold on a second, everyone. Is it this one? No response. No. Is it on the other side of the church? Okay, no. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I just saw a coin on the ground. Ooh, lucky. All right, let's hold on to that. Knock, knock. No. Can we just knock on every door in the house? Knock. No response. Was that not the house? Oh, this is Aubrey's house, right? Okay. All right, let's bounce out. I swear, I thought there was a thing where it's like, hey, come visit us or something. Okay, Basil's house. Knock, knock. Did I miss the prompt, maybe? Oh man, that sucks, I guess. Oh, what the heck? It's artist lady. Uh, my Lucas my door, he's always trying to get out of the house. Sometimes I wonder if he only lives here for food. Sigh, where do you go this time? Okay, so we're missing a dog. All right, noted. I guess let's knock on Basil's house just in case. No response, okay. Well, I guess time to go to, you know, Kel's house. Let's see all the beauty of that, right? Wait, did I, go, did I ever go this way? Oh. I don't think I've been this way! What? Why the house is so much bigger? Knock knock. No response. Wow, look how big that house is. Like, what the hell? Ooh, dude, look at the double-decker! Or, it's not double, it's like triple, like, front. Then there's like a nice garage area. Like, oh my gosh. Ooh, that's the same one, but it has a different colored roof. Like, oh my gosh. Okay, no? No response, okay. Oops, can I cut it? Nope, okay, can't. All right, okay, now I'll go back. I promise y'all, we'll get there, we'll get there. Good dog, oh! Wait, no, you're the artist dog! Dog, come back! Did we grab him? Wait, no, 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 we gotta go to Artist Lady's house, and which was down here. Like, we grabbed him, right? Like, it wasn't just... Oh. What the heck? Man, we found your dog! You got trash. Thank you. Sorry, Lucas. Hey, did you send Lucas back here? I'm sorry for the trouble. Here, take this. Can you give me trash? Oh, a paintbrush! Thank you! Okay. I swear we're gonna go meet Hero. It's fine. It's fine. Though we did get trash, so I want to make sure I cash that in for money. Dude, 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 dude. Where's the trash lady? There we go. Okay, one dollar. Awesome. I wish I had trash that I could just give to people for money. I mean, I know actually that is a thing, but I guess I just don't know any near my house. Into the kill's house. Before we go in, I should probably mention that my mom is going to be a little bit mad about taking so long with the groceries. I was supposed to bring back everything around noon, but I got carried away doing the other stuff, so, well, you know how it goes. But anyway, I thought of a solution for this. So, I think you should walk in first. That way she'll see you first and get all excited. And most importantly, she'll forget to yell at me. See, it's a win-win for everybody. <laughs> Got it? Okay, let's go. Oops, that was gross. Okay. Hector. Oh, Hector's a dog. Oh, you're such a good boy. Bark, bark. Oh, baby. The dog seems content. Oh my god. I want to pet you again. You pet the dog. Bark, bark. Oh. So cute, Hector. Oh, you have such cute cheeks. Oh, my more. Okay, awesome. You're such a good boy, Hector. Mrs. Kel. Mom, Sunny's here. <sighs> Oof. What took you so long, Kel? I sent you off hours ago. How long did it take you to get a bunch of sandwiches? Oh my, is that sunny? It must be. It's so good to see you again. But dear, you look so thin. Have you been eating properly? Here's the stuff you asked for, Mom. You gave the baking order and the pizza order to Kel's mom. 
Hey, wait, Sonny, let's go upstairs in my bedroom. Now, wait just a second, young man. Bye, Mom. See you when dinner's done. Yeah, boy, he's yelling. Awesome. Wow, his house is so lively. Is this his house? Oh, well, here it is. Make yourself at home. And look, I always got the basketball hoop and the boombox just like I always wanted. Here, I play a song for you. Oh, that's so nice. Why is this hero side just full of trophies? Doo -doo. Yep, it's pretty sweet. Mama won't let me play it too loud, though, because she says it will be bad for Sally. Who's Sally? Oh, wait! You haven't met Sally yet, huh? <laughs> Guess what, Sonny? I'm a big brother now. Sally's my baby sister. My mom will probably bring her downstairs around dinner time. She's really small and really cute. <laughs> Kel, there's a girl at the door. She says she's here to see you. A girl at the door? Huh, I wonder who that could be. Oh, please tell me it's Aubrey. I mean, who else could it be? Mari's dead, right? Oh, no. Polly? Hey, Kel. Hey, Sunny. Sorry for intruding. I was just wondering if you know where Basil is. I thought he might be with you. Basil? Hmm. We did see him at the park earlier, but that was a while ago. If you see him, can you tell him to come home? I'm really worried about him. Of course, Polly. We'll be on the lookout. Thanks. I knew I could count on you guys. Huh, okay. Basil's missing today. I have a bad feeling about this. Especially with Aubrey and Scooter getting around. Maybe we should try and find him before it gets dark. Can we go looking for him, Mom? Pretty please? Well, that girl did look awfully worried. <sighs> okay, just make sure to be home by dinner. Alright, out to save the day. Oh, wait, Hector, 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 Hector. We need to pick the dog. Pick the dog. Oh, oh. Wait, 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 one more, one more. Oh, oh. Ooh, baby, you're so cute. Okay, time to go find, um. Ba Basil. <laughs> Basil. Uh, okay, let's double check the park because we, we know there's like a secret area behind the park, right? So hopefully they're not beating him up or some shit. Okay, let's save. Should we be asking around to see if people have found him? Oh, this feels like a vibe, right? Man, where could Basil be? I don't see him anywhere. Is this like a secret area? Somebody help! Sunny, did you hear that? I think that was Basil. Help me, please! Where's this voice coming from? Hold on a sec, I know this area. Basil's voice is coming down from our old hangout spot. How do we- yeah, how do you get in? The entrance should be still somewhere around here. Is it not? Okay, yeah. New area. Ooh, construction, what the hell? Ah, getting stuck, getting stuck. <gasps> oh. Help me! Somebody! What the heck are you yelling for, Basil? They're making a scene. This place is our secret hangout spot. You can't be here because you weren't invited. Dang it, Basil. Be quiet. Someone's gonna find this place. Yeah, we're not trying to hurt you. We just, we just want to get you out of here. Oh, man. Hey, stop it! What are you doing to Basil? What the- Crumble, crumble. It's Kel and Sunny again. Why do you always show up? How do you even find this place? Come on, Aubrey. We gotta defend our turf. It's not your turf. This was our old- <sighs> Aubrey. Her. Go away, Kel. You're not welcome here. This is our spot. Oh, this is your spot now. Well, this used to be our old hangout spot, wasn't it, Aubrey? Watch her. We'll mess you up. Hey, let's go into battle. 5v2? Fine. If that's how it's gonna be, then at least stop bullying Basil. We weren't even doing anything to him. He just started screaming for no reason. Yeah, sure you weren't. Why should I believe you? We're telling the truth. Stop being such a self-righteous prick. Come on, guys. Let's make sure this is the last time those two mess with us. This sounds good to me. I'm right behind you, Maverick. Oh, shit. I should have prepared. Oh, God. Please be okay. Let's settle this, Kel. If you and Sunny are going to pick a fight with me and my friends, you got one. Come on, gang. Dude, come on! Six versus two? Holy fuck. Oh. Dude, this is no fair. This is like not even a fair fight. Come on, the side of RNG. Give me RNG. Please just help me right now. I don't have enough band-aids for this shit. Come on. Oh, come on! 
Like, it, I, I'm surprised there isn't like a weapon store or something, you know? Oh god, it's really doing nothing. Man, the old hangout spot kind of looks like the area in the game, in the other world. Yeah, no, I did not prepare for a fight. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Tall is not knocked out. Okay, Sunny. You got it, Sunny. Okay, no you don't. No you don't, Sunny. No you don't! Oh no! We need like knives or something. Haha. <laughs> is this in the real life? We want Master, we want to you right knives. I'm hungry, so this is a test. Whoa, we really did it. The evil foe- Dude, it's six uh, on th on two! Why do you say on six people once, even though a bunch of dweebs? It's over, Kel. Leave this place. You don't belong here anymore. Like, come on! No, I won't. I can't just leave here knowing that this is the person you become. I mean, what would Mari think? Why do you keep bringing her up? Do I have to keep saying it? Mari's already dead. Can you just stop with that? And while you're at it, drop the tough guy act too. I don't believe you when you say you don't care about us anymore. You have all your new friends now, but you're still hanging out with your old hangout spot. Do I really have to spell it out for you? Man, Kel is like spitting out truths here. Don't listen to him, Aubrey. He's just spying crap like usual. Right, Aubrey? Man. Sigh. This isn't fun anymore. I want to go home. Let's get out of here. You said it. Kim, go. Kim, go. Your brother's leaving. Yeah, that's what I thought. You coming, Aubrey? Oh, okay. Catch you later, then. Yes, give me the explosion of truth here. Aubrey. Ugh. Ugh! Why? Why do you guys keep coming back? I just want you to leave me alone. Sunny, why? Why did you show up now? We just wanted you to stop messing with Basil. What's your deal with them all of a sudden? You used to be friends. We all used to be. Oh man, the truth. Give me the truth. You think I'm a bully, but you're all messed up too. Where were you when Mari died? Where were you, any of you? And you. You're the worst, Basil. How dare you still show your face to me after what you did? What do you do? Push him in. Aubrey, I- Get away from me! He can't- What if he can't swim? Shoot. What the heck, Aubrey? What are you doing? You've taken this way too far. Wait, hold on. I didn't mean to. Sunny, don't worry about Aubrey. I'll keep her busy. Just go help Basil. I mean, okay. Let's go. Do you want to save Basil? Oh! <laughs> oh my god, can I not? Heck yeah, dude. Why would we not want to save Basil? What the hell? I'm really curious. There's like, are there multiple endings in Amori? I would assume there's only like one. Considering this, that, the, the, that this is like one big long RPG, but... Maybe I'm wrong. Oh shoot. Oh gosh. Mori? No, Sunny. My bad. Mari? No, it's Mari! Yes, please. Mari goes to help me. Lead me, Mari. Lead me. Yes, getting closer. Ooh, look at those tentacle arms. Mari, no! Why did I stop? Yes, give me the knife. Mari? What? I wonder how Mari died. Ah, uh, ba did Basil kill Mari? Oh my gosh. Something drags you down. Oh no, we need to calm down. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> Sorry. 
something. Something. Steady your heartbeat. Don't be afraid. It's not as scary as you think. Let's go. You have to keep going. Don't give up. No matter how impossible it seems. You reach out to the voice and you remember how to persist. Persist? Alright. Oh dang, yeah, I can see super clearly now. I mean, there's no way I'm going to defeat this, right? Like, it's just- it's just not gonna happen. So many focuses. So he takes eight damage. Why are the attacks not doing anything? I should just keep trying to persist because it doesn't seem like um yeah it doesn't really seem like the attacks are gonna do much sunny oh no Is it hero, maybe? <gasps> hero! Hero! Oh. Hmm. Oh, hero's so cool. Looks like Battles is breathing is steady, but we need to get him somewhere warm quickly. Yeah, he's had a rough day. Let's get him home as soon as possible. Wait! Where do you think you're all going? That's enough! Don't you think you've caused enough trouble? Come on guys, we gotta go. Wait, but like, what about Aubrey's side of the story? But, it looks like Basil's being stayed, but we should bring it- I mean, okay. So sad though. <sighs> Basil, what happened? Is he okay? He's breathing. His breath. His breathing is stable. He just needs a change of clothes and a warm bed. Okay, I can do that. Oh, quick, come inside. You're so cool. Can you help me bring him to his room? Sure thing. Phew, that was intense. I hope Basil wakes up soon. Yeah, I hope he wakes up soon too.